What's this? Bees in a tube? This is a scene in the late winter of an observation hive at an office at Betterby. It's one of the coolest things to have in your house that I can think of. And one way that you can also be cool is to get one. Sit down any time of the day or night and stare at your bees. I got very good at spotting queens with my observation hive. You can watch the queen searching for cells to lay in and then doing that egg-laying job. I like to mark on the glass with an erasable marker. If you accidentally use permanent marker, alcohol will get that off. Here, I tracked when Queenie started to lay in the winter and then how big the brood nest got over time. This gives me a sense of what's going on in the hives outside, too. It's fun to watch bees that are on the comb on the dance floor, dancing to tell their sisters where the best pollen is, for example, like this girl here is doing. Usually an observation hive gets quite crowded in the spring if you keep it set up all the time, and it needs to be weakened about once a month by moving a frame of brood out and into the large hive. This is done by taking the observation hive outdoors. Then that frame you took out is replaced with a frame of comb or foundation. Or you can watch the bees create comb on a frame that has no foundation, which is super cool to watch. Have fun with your observation hives.